Welcome back to Siem Reap, known around the world as Cambodia's Temple City. Of course, Angkor Wat is the most iconic and most visited, but the jungle temple of Taprom isn't far behind. Well, it's an impressive entrance. Yes, it is. Many people are very impressed by that. <laughs> so what does Taprom mean? Ta means grandfather. Prom means the top of the roof. It means we are protected by grandfather. Right. Prom. Walking into this place, I feel a bit like Indiana Jones, like I'm some explorer discovering it for the first time. Yeah, sure, because this place is lost in the jungle for 400 years. So it was covered in jungle, it took over. This is covered in jungle. Wow. And so what would it have been before that in its day? During its day, this place is used as a university. It means that it's very crowded with students wow. sent from all over the empire. So it would have been bustling, like a university campus, people studying, learning things. Yeah, the most topic they study in this place is study the way of life in Buddhist way. Mm -hmm. In order to live in the pure life, you have to learn. So a pure life. Pure life. You have to learn the way of life in Buddhism. The balance between architecture and the force of nature is what makes the temple both incredibly mysterious and unique. Everyone has their favourites, and Angkor Wat is amazing. But for me, there's something really special about this temple. It's intimate, you can really absorb every detail, and the fact that the jungle is so close really makes you feel like you're stepping back in time. They say there's more to Angkor than it's what, but there's also more to see and reap than it's temples. And if you don't go out and explore, you're really missing out. Hello. And of course, to really experience it, you need to sample some local pastimes. Okay, one, two, three. All right. Cool. <laughs> Oh, OK. <laughs> ah, well, suffice to say, it tickles. <laughs> I don't know if it's a sign that I've got particularly filthy feet, but these fish are in the middle of a frenzy right now. So what's your advice to get the most from this experience? For me, you just got to relax. Don't relax. think about it. Think about something else. And when you finish, your feet will feel amazing. So you genuinely feel like your feet feel different? Like, well, the new skin just softer and smoother? Really soft, no, like, dry skin, everything's gone, nails feel clean. So you might as well just jump in and I'll have a bath. Yeah, you right? should go for it. I'd like yeah. to see you do that. I'll yeah, do it yeah. after you. <laughs> OK, yeah. <laughs> I think enough time has passed now that I'm into it. I'm actually quite enjoying it. I feel much more relaxed. My feet feel rejuvenated. Makes me resent goldfish. They don't work nearly hard enough, as far as I'm concerned. These fish, they're doing the real work. As well as free time for exploring and all the free choice excursions, Scenic offers exclusive events known as Scenic and Rich. And this one is set to blow your mind. Set within a private temple dating back to the 8th century, this is the dining experience of a lifetime. Nothing can quite prepare you for a night like this. From the moment you walk in, you feel like royalty. And everything from the lighting to the entertainment to the food is absolutely first class. Even the dinner conversation. What an incredible way to finish our time at CM Reap.